6, we are working the very latest developments in a drowning investigation we have been covering for weeks. The tragic death of a woman whose body went unnoticed for days in a Fall River public pool has led to the resignation of three state workers. We've also learned a city health inspector has been fired. The pool in Fall River has been closed since late last month when the body of Marie Joseph was found. State investigators released preliminary findings into her drowning today. It was breaking news on Eyewitness News at noon. They found that the pool should not have been open the day Marie Joseph drowned because of murky water. Investigators also say there were not enough lifeguards watching the area when Joseph went under. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly was the only local reporter who went to Boston for today's news conference. He joins us live from Fall River with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom with the very latest. Yes, this public pool here in Fall River is still shut down tonight and the three top officials directly in charge of it have resigned nearly a month after a drowning death here. Morning. Former Fall River Mayor Ed Lambert now runs the state agency in charge of public pools in Massachusetts. Eyewitness News was in Boston today when he revealed the results of an investigation into the drowning death of 36-year-old Marie Joseph in this pool in Fall River. We believe the degree of cloudiness in the pool was a factor that contributed to the inability of anyone to detect Ms. Joseph's body in the deep end of the pool. Marie Joseph's body went undetected for two days after she drowned in late June. Investigators say a surveillance video shows she disappeared only six seconds after she entered the water and that the water was dangerously cloudy. As a result, the state asked for and got the resignations of three pool officials blamed for making bad decisions. DCR standards call for, for a pool to be closed if at any time any part of the pool becomes too cloudy to detect an object on the bottom of the pool. Now, pool checks will include in-the-water inspections and water quality tests will now gauge the visibility of special black and white discs placed at the bottom of the pool. Commissioner, could you delineate for us what you hope would be Marie Joseph's legacy? To Marie Joseph's family, our sincerest condolences. Um, uh, we, uh, we recognize your heartache, we share in that heartache, uh, and we're going to do our best to use this incident in a constructive way to build and maintain public confidence was internal. Bristol County District Attorney Sam Sutter is conducting a separate investigation into the possibility of criminal negligence. Live in Fall River with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.